All right, we're back. It's been about eight days, actually, since we allowed this banana mash. If you remember, I mashed all this up, and we added some sugar to it, um, put, some, put some water to it as well. Uh, and again, three-quarter cup of sugar, uh, half a liter of water, and then one banana. So, and I even rubbed the banana a little bit with some of the, on the peel to try to get some of that wild-type yeast going. But anyway, we let this uh, basically ferment for about a week, and I poured some of that solution into my column here, and I'm gonna put in this hydrometer, and we're gonna calculate essentially what the percent alcohol by volume is. So interestingly enough, we have, we are observing an increase in the alcohol. So whereas we started with about 1.1 as a specific gravity whenever it was just the uh, solution I should say the, the mixture, even the suspension with some of the banana in it, but mostly it was just the sugar water. We had measured 1.1. Here it's about 1.106, and that equates to a 0.77, or about a 0.8% alcohol by volume. So we have an increase in alcohol by volume. It hasn't been much, but then again, we didn't add any other yeast to it. We're just using natural wild type of yeast that will be naturally found on and in the banana, and the fermentation process then just gives us what this you know is basically so 0 0.8 is the alcohol by volume reading after about eight days of fermentation